three, two, one. How y'all doing out there today in the YouTube.com, Jamestown, North Carolina show going on right now. It's Saturday night, pretty much Saturday night. The government wants, wants all the youths to go out and party, drink, and get as fucked up as they could possibly can so they could pay their FBI agents since um, FBI agents are, it's legal for them to use and get as high as they want and also really not to watch other people and distribute but because they're doing it themselves they're the only ones allowing it into the country and they're the only ones allowing it to be distributed thus they're breaching the system all FBI agents, all CIA agents have breached the contract of the people's United States number one. Now the war isn't overseas, the war is pretty much really close and the war is in countries that are being hostile to us because the war on drugs is illegal. Certain people want to keep the Dairy Farmers or the Dairy Farmers and Denzel Washington's act going so they could spy on individuals and allow them to be in charge of the monopoly while the rest of us are getting pretty much destroyed economically. And anytime there's a discrepancy of the uh, marketplace, then the FBI goes in there and spies on the individual. That way they can go to other countries and go and bust other people. And then they come out for us over here and it's starting to get to be a ridiculous war on drugs that President Bush Sr. declared when that virtual fence should have already been there and we could lower it all the way down to Caracas I don't give a shit because as far as I'm concerned Al Qaeda and all this crap's coming from down over there sanctioned by the drug war also all attacks make the police go down to the attack areas and that allows the drug war to continue so the distribution goes on and all this bullshit about fucking Bloomberg's plan is a bunch of fucking horse shit manure. Now we're going to have to make a choice of how we're going to want to fight or lead this war on drugs. Either the areas where the drugs are coming from, it's going to have to stay legal down there so people could go down there and use your drugs, or the drug war is going to continue the way it's going. Basically the government spies on people, sets people up, and then they have people go work for them, and that's the only person using it. Other people get pretty much hurt because they're mixing the shit and also the whole war on drugs is phony because marijuana is state ran or legal but not federal legal when it's not causing cancer when cigarettes are causing cancer. That is take five.